you have databases, data storage, um, graphics, sound, um, just getting the framework of the game together, especially if you build your own engine. Building your own engine is so impressive and um, that's why I'm working on one as mainly just a resume builder. Being an informatics student at IU starting out, it's just overwhelming exactly how much information you can get as long as you spend the time and understand that this is a college university. This isn't a high school where you're being spoon-fed the information. This is some place where you can come to grow as long as you have the motivation to grow. Uh, but in general, I think informatics is about using computing systems and technology to solve problems in the context of another domain. And there's really no limit for what these domains are. I mean, we could be talking about arts, sciences, uh, uh, humanities, we could be talking about uh, business, healthcare, health sciences, or actually you name it. Well, if you think, if you look at the way we live right now, everything related, uh, everything we do has something to do with uh, technology. And informatics is all based on working with technology and developing new technologies. Yeah, my experience has been great here at IU Kokomo. Um, I never really knew what I was going to get from the outcome. I thought I was just going to come here, take classes, and graduate. But within that experience, I've learned that there's a lot more to get earning your degree. I see myself as working in game development at some point, not so much. It's actually not a good field to get into, per se, because it's so competitive. But um, getting in on a game company startup is just a great resume builder because it's such general purpose programming. You use all the programming skills in game development. At first it's not that easy because you don't really know what you're getting yourself into. But after you, after you meet with them, discuss a lot of the things that you're going to be doing, it gets, it gets easier. From my vantage point, what I see is a fresh approach to programming, uh, to understanding technology and its usage. And I see where the students that I interact with have the latitude to decide to do something that they feel invested in, that explores their own creativity in order to get to that learning outcome.